Internet Marketing – Steps That You Must Complete To Be Successful Step 1. Build a website, you build or contract it out, why? It legitimizes your business. The Yellow Pages used to do that, now, a website on the internet legitimizes your business. To market your business and be looked at as a player in your marketplace, you must have a website. Only do it yourself if you have the skills, otherwise hire a professional to do it for you. Make sure the site reflects you, your product, and the message you want to convey. Step 2. Select a hosting company for your site. Why? There are a myriad of hosting companies to choose from. Cheaper does not always mean better. Decide on the hosting company based on your needs. Do you need a hosting company that specializes in hosting business websites? How critical is the uptime percentage of the hosting company's computers, the percentage of time your site will be available for viewing to your potential customers? Do they support Windows versus Mac or both operating systems? Do your research. They may all look the same, but they do not all provide the same tools. Step 3. Start a blog. Why? It helps your customers get to know you and interact with you. You can use it to update information, introduce new products or ideas, receive feedback. Most important, a blog will funnel traffic to your main site. You can set up a basic blog for free. Step 4. Select a hosting company for your blog that will funnel traffic to your website. Why? Some blog hosting sites maintain intellectual control over any content produced on their hosting platform. If that is not important to you, then use the blog hosting company that also produces the blogging software that you use to produce your blog. To maintain control of anything that you produce on your blog, articles, videos, etc., then you need to host the blog on a separate hosting site, possibly the same hosting company that you use to host your website. Step 5. Set up a Facebook account, personal and business, that will funnel traffic to your website. Why? Exposure. 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 Facebook is the number two website for unique visitors. Become friends with others in your industry and outside of your industry. Establish relationships. Build trust. To market your business on Facebook, you must know the rules or they will suspend your account. It is free to set up an account. Step 6. Set up a Twitter account that will drive traffic to your website. Why? It is another medium of exposure. Social networking will help increase communication with your customers. It is free to set up an account. Step 7. Advertise on Google Why? Google has the most traffic of any site on the internet. It has the potential to introduce your product or service to the most people. Google has stringent marketing rules. Get a seasoned person to help you market on Google or hire a professional to do it for you. It costs you to advertise on Google, the rewards can be great if you do it right. Step 8. Advertise on Yahoo Why? Yahoo is probably the number 5 site for unique visitors during a given time frame. They have less stringent rules for advertising and would be a good site to start advertising on. There are other steps to marketing on the internet, you have just reviewed a few of the most important ones. Do the above steps properly and you will send traffic to your site.